Hello everybody, welcome to Scotty Gaming. Today I'm going to show you where to get the epic DR12 Quasar Magnum Pistol. It fires, sorry, it can fire two bullets at the same time. You are going to have to grind to get the right stats roll, but this is where you find it. It's located in Westbrook and in the northeast, you've got an island by itself. It's, it's dead easy to find. It's really distinguishable. And there is an NCPD quest here. If you've already done this quest, the likelihood is you've already picked the weapon up and not got the stat roll you want so just be mindful of that but the easiest way to get into the complex is to drive to the main entrance which is just here looks like this but don't go through the main entrance because it's all it, there's quite a lot of enemies in here just run up this mountain to the back if you've got double jump it's going to be very very handy i don't know if you can get in here with a single jump you probably can yeah that was a single jump so you, you can get in here with a single jump um, you're going to want to turn off this camera here. There's a turret just to the right. There's also two or three enemies. But I normally just turn this turret off. Now once it's done, the enemies walk past each other, so you should be easy. Yeah, happy days. And you've got this. Now this one we've got reduces charge time. This is not the one we want. So what I would recommend you do is don't pick up anything out the box unless it's the one you want. Make a save right in front of the box. Because what will happen is when you load your save game up, it's going to refresh the contents of the box, refresh the stats on the pistol until you get the one that fires two rounds at the same time. So let's load it up, baby. I doubt I'm going to get lucky in this video showing you the... The pick show, actually showing you me picking up the pistol because I had to grind for about 20 to 30 minutes to get it on my my player save. But this is just to show you how to do it and how to refresh it to make it as time efficient as possible. So there we go in front of the box. Now sometimes the enemies do change paths when you save it like that. Say he's going to see me but look the weapon's not the one we want so we'll load it up again. Yeah I have noticed that even if you save somewhere, as soon as you load it in, enemy paths can change, they can also change locations, so just be mindful of that. It would be easier if you just killed everyone on the way in, but I couldn't be bothered. <laughs> I couldn't be bothered, what's that? Reduces charge time for tech weapons, 1.66%. We don't want that. Another thing that you can be mindful of as well, I don't know if it's possible, but you can get this weapon with varying from zero to four weapon mod slots the pistol that i got has only got two weapon mod slots but i couldn't be bothered to grind for a perfect one that's if you can even get a perfect one i don't know this will be the last save and load i've got to see what we get there we go lads we've got it right hold on i'm probably gonna get slaughtered here Get wrecked. This guy's been a cocksucker. Oh, do you know what it is? Give us some of this. This is not the smoothest thing you've ever seen. <laughs> this is not the smoothest infiltration or video you've ever seen in your life, but we did find a one there we go so fires two rounds at once but significantly lowers the rate of fire that's what we want and this one has also only got two weapon mod slots which is fair enough but as you can see it's got better dps than my legendary dr12 quasar which i got on a mission somewhere um so there we go that's where you find it that's what the stats look like. This is the fastest way to save and load your game right in front of the box. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you get the one you want. See you in the next one, lads.